WTFNN. Headline News Update. And welcome to the 2 p.m. update with me, David White. And what do we have today? Well, a little bit of a pullback and a question right away is, uh, do we have any kind of volume that signals either some kind of blow off bottom or uh, not much? And we're still in the trading range. So we go to the CBOE. And what do we have? Uh, 6.1 billion shares. So it's a snooze fest. Uh, we are probably more likely in a trading range. Doesn't mean you can't go down a little bit further. I suspect, though, uh, that we continue to kind of uh, dance around and go a little bit higher through next week. Fund buying actually starts, and it's supposed to start on Monday, but generally, for the most part, everybody keeps pushing it off and back, uh, uh, moving it back a little bit. And of course, uh, start seeing on Monday some uh, markup uh, to sell those folks that must buy at a certain time each month. Uh, I never understood it, it uh, especially if you have a 401k and you've got some kind of fun, you're probably getting massively screwed over every month. But, uh, hey, what the hey? What can you say? Uh, anyway, uh, as we said, uh, on a shortened week, we've got lighter volume. Uh, right now, uh, as we look off 50 on the S&P cash, down 364 on the Dow Nasdaq, down 223. Some of the bigger movers uh, out here today that many are talking about uh, on earnings uh, is, did, 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 where is it at? Let's do it alphabetically. Autodesk down 12 point or 12 percent excuse me down 27 on the day aes uh, what do we have here let's go back to some other ones there we go uh other ones out there moderna's down about six percent eog resources down five and a half boeing uh has uh its uh lawsuit that everybody thought was settled uh getting reopened and uh they are seeing the wrath of those folks down about four and a half percent. We'll be back in a minute and do the really big show.